In this video, I will show you how to solve the permission denied, missing or insufficient permission. Okay, let's start. This is my project. Here I have used Cloud Firestore database. When I have created the new account, I am facing the error of permission denied and missing or insufficient permission. So just follow my steps to fix the issue. First, open the Cloud. This is the link for first open the Firebase console then create uh, this is my existing project so now i have to create a new project so I just click the drop down and then add a project so here i have to use the sampler and then now click continue and then now click continue then choose the any account or click a create new account i use the existing account then create new project <coughs> Here we have to delete the existing Google services.json file, then replace the new one. This is my existing uh, existing image and uh, old google.services.json. So here we have to delete the file. So we want to delete the file, then restore the new Google services.json file. So let's wait. First, you have to create a cloud Firestore database, not a Firebase. <coughs> then click continue. So here we have to download the. Now you have to add the app. So here we have to the Android app. Now you have to so just listen here. Here our project name is Sample App. Now we have to integrate the existing Android project into Cloud Firestore. So suppose if you are using Apple, then you have to click iOS. Suppose you are using web app, then you have to click the web. Now here we have sorry. Now we are using Android app. So now click the Android app. Then just Copy the package name. So, this is our package name. Just copy that. Already have the sample, uh, sample package name. So, here I have to dummy. Already I use the package name. So, just add uh, some extra line. So, it's an option. Just leave empty. Then click register app. And now the next step we have to download the JSON file. So this is a JSON file. So now just copy the JSON file and paste from the existing Android project. So now you have to delete the Google.services JSON file and then paste the new project. Sorry, paste the new JSON file. Just copy and then paste from this location. Already I have pasted that, so here I don't do anything. And the next step is next. Already we are integrated, it's already integrated in my project, so I don't need any tool to change that. So already everything was imported so like Firebase Firestore. And the next step is next. Then continue the console. So this is the step for create a Firestore database in a Google Firefile. So here we have total two of sample app and video audio. Cloud Firestore. So here already I have two users. So every time the new user create an account, the email ID, first name, last name, with the username, password, everything stored in the Cloud Firestore. So this is a concept for fix the permission denied, missing or insufficient permission. So end of the video, the objective is just create a, just go down the link, then create a. Firestore database then add your app in 
through the package name and just delete the this is a very important just delete the uh, google services json file and add your own json file then it will be successfully uh, executed suppose if you are facing any issue just comment below i will explain how to fix the issue and thank you